Love, Victor, Hulu's spin-off series from the popular film Love, Simon, has already captivated us all. Season 2 had one of the strongest cliffhangers so far, and we are already excited about the third upcoming season. Until its release, let's go through the best moments in Love, Victor Season 1 and 2. The Boys Trip the series features the story of Victor, who is a new student at Creekwood High School on his own journey of self-discovery, facing challenges at home, adjusting to a new city, and coping with his true identity. He is then encouraged by his friend Simon as he helped him go through the ups and downs of high school. Now, this video is about the best moments in the show, but we couldn't go on without mentioning the whole boys trip situation. The whole episode is truly amazing. In The Boys Trip, we saw Victor going on a trip to New York to visit Simon. Then, Bram and Simon's roommates are all there for Victor. During the episode, we saw that Victor finally got the support he needs from these people, who make him feel great despite having just met him. For the first time, Victor is not feeling bad about showing off his true identity. And by the end of the episode, you'll feel all kinds of feelings from sadness to happiness and excitement. From Bram, right? How was your trip? It was good. Oh, so excited to meet you. <laughs> Victor with Simon Spear and Katya Zamalovchikova. According to most fans, the This Is Drag scene is one of the best moments in the series. During this scene, we saw that Simon is really lucky to have the support of his friends and family. And unfortunately, not everyone can have that. The episode also presented the gay culture in an entertaining way that we haven't seen in TV shows or movies before. Michael Cimino and Tommy Dorfman's performances were simply perfect, as they both made the scene look so realistic. And while it's not something that moves the plot a lot, it is truly a well-presented storyline. Oh, we also need to mention Michael's exhalation of comfort when he is hugged by the NY gang. What do you guys think about this? Well, we really felt his exhale. Nevertheless, this is definitely one of the best moments in the show. Do you guys agree? Don't forget to share your opinion in the comments. Uh, it's been the best night of my life. Victor's Awakening When you learn about your true identity, a lot of things can take the wrong turn. As you all know, most people struggle when discovering they're gay because they're not sure if they're going to get acceptance by their closet ones. Victor's journey in the show starts when he meets the beautiful girl in school, Mia. And then we see that he still learns about his sexuality. He believes he could fall in love with this girl that everyone thinks is attractive. But then he sees Benji. And this certainly goes in the best moments we've seen in Love, Victor. Victor is literally fascinated with Benji at first sight. And it's not like Benji does something to impress Victor. He's simply drinking from the fountain and putting his hair behind his ears. What follows is a really awkward situation, but there's no doubt that fans will not forget this moment between Victor and Benji, especially after the second season questioned their relationship. No, they are. It sounds like those shoes were your destiny. If you believe in that kind. Of Felix and Lake. Certainly one of the most touching moments in the first season is between Felix and Lake. After getting to know Lake's relationship with her mother a little better, Felix decided to show support and comfort her, saying that she's not alone. In order to make her feel better, Felix brought Lake to his apartment, and even Victor hasn't been there. However, he then says that his mother struggles with hoarding. How did you guys feel about this moment? Oh, honey, no, even as far as boy bags go, that is a very ugly backpack. <laughs> um. Dawn is thankful. Felix's mother Dawn comes back home in the second season and everyone is smiling because of it. She tells interesting stories that happened to her at the facility and what we love the most is the fact that Dawn is really great as she fought during those difficult situations in order to make her son happy. Felix explains that he and Lake broke up because he felt portrayed and then Dawn says to Felix that she will be forever grateful for Lake, easily one of the best moments in the show. Lake and I broke up. Oh, Felix, I'm so sorry. What happened? Victor comes out. Throughout season one, Victor came out a couple of times. There were some accidental occasions, but there were also some truly outstanding coming out scenes that we fans can't forget. So let's talk about when Victor decides to come out to Felix. 
This was one of the most hurtful scenes to watch, as Victor was really nervous when he told her the news, and he quickly regretted it, but Felix is really supportive, and the whole thing ends up pretty well. Then the second coming out scene was at the end of the first season, when Victor comes back home from the dance with Pillar, and he's ready to share the big news with his parents. However, the moment he decides to do this, his parents announce their coming separation, so Victor changes his mind. Then Victor decides to end the first season by saying, I'm gay, to his parents, and we couldn't be happier about it. Mom, Dad, I'm gay. Benji and Victor We have to admit, there were so many dramatic moments in season 2 that we truly appreciated seeing Victor and Benji being in a relationship. Seeing these two finally enjoying their time together was really adorable. And we can't wait to see if Victor has chosen him at the end of the second season. Which team are you guys on? Team Raheem or Team Benji? Let us know in the comments section below. Oh, and don't forget to smack that like button if you haven't done it already. Lake and Lucy As we previously mentioned, the end of season 2 was filled with surprising moments including the one between Lake, portrayed by B.B. Wood, and Lucy, portrayed by Ava Capri. Is this the beginning of a new relationship? Well, it seems to be happening, finally. It looks like season two ended with the hope of a bisexual relationship between two women that will probably be the focus of the third season. In the finale, Felix, Anthony Turpel, rejects Lake and she faces her classmate Lucy, who tries to comfort her. For what it's worth, I never really saw you with him anyway, she says. Who do you see me with? Lake asks her. Then Lucy says, someone totally different. Then they enjoy their company with a bottle of champagne. Do you guys think this is the beginning of a new bisexual relationship? Let us know. Would you want to go hang out? Isabel apologizes to Benji. In a crucial moment, the finale of season 2 shows how developed Isabel's character is. Benji didn't go to the wedding, so Isabel decides to visit him at the cafe. She then apologizes for being the reason he and Victor broke up. And yes, this was, according to most fans, one of the best moments in the show. It's perfectly clear she regrets her past decisions. But then, Benji says to her that their problems are bigger than that. Isabel then comforts him. What matters is how hard you're willing to work at it. How much of yourself you're willing to... Josh Dumel's Season 2 Cameo We always are like, what's a natural way to bring the Love Simon world into our Love Victor world? That felt like a way to do it, the showrunner Elizabeth Berger told EW. One of the best moments in the show is without a doubt the moment when a star from Love Simon appeared to help the lead of Love Victor. For a brief moment, Josh Duhamel made a cameo in episode 3 of Love, Victor season 2, playing the role of Jack Spear, Simon's father from Love, Simon. Jack is now supportive of LGBTQ people through P. Flag, and those of you who have seen Love, Simon knows how significant his role is in the film. In Love, Victor, he has discussions at the support group with Victor's father, Armando, James Martinez, about how important it is for Armando to be there for Victor. Personally, our favorite moment in the show. And weird and complicated coming out can be, not just for the people doing it, but for all of us. What is, according to you, the best moment in Love, Victor? Is there any moment worth mentioning that we forgot? Let us know in the comments section below. If you enjoyed our video, make sure you subscribe to our channel so you never miss any of our videos in the future. As always, thanks for watching.